That's right. Um, all of you guys, I love you guys. You guys make it awesome. Uh, I want to let you guys know uh, one of my best friends and, and mentors in my life called me about two days before this race and was diagnosed with a, a terrible illness. And uh, I, I dedicated this race to him. Mm. Um, you'll be watching this, so you know who you are. Um, and. Uh, this is so simple, guys. I want you to know that there's nothing special about us. My feet are macerated. <laughs> my quads have been locking up since hour 20. The top of my foot hurt so bad because I laced my shoes so tight in the beginning that it, it literally almost makes you cry. You never heard one word come out of my mouth about any of that, did you? That's what makes a difference. <laughs> thank you to my crew, and most especially thank you to John and Becky. We love you guys. Yeah. 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 Amen. Yeah. I've been waiting 38 hours to shake your hands. 122 and 38 hours. Yep. 37 pounds. It's like the slowest 122 mile race ever. <laughs> <laughs> but the longest going podcast episode. <laughs> <laughs> Luke's coming on the 307 podcast yeah. within the next few weeks. Get him, Big John. What? What's going on? I'm sure you have a speech or something. Oh, you know, I didn't. I didn't prepare a speech. I don't. Um. I ain't never shot you before. <laughs> Fair enough. Fair enough. I'll see what I can do. Um. You guys put a lot of work into this, man. First of all, I didn't know what else to do. Thank you. To get to get two individuals that are willing to sacrifice themselves physically and mentally for each other is why we are all here. That is why this this race exists. To pull the best out of each and every person that started 38 hours ago to get those 96 people to give everything they could possibly give so one man could run 1.1 mile by himself. <laughs> Each and every person earned it today mm -hmm. and yesterday. 
Thank you for showing up. We're beyond humbled and grateful for everyone. We are incredibly thankful for you two gentlemen. Thank you. We've got some stuff for you. Um, Al's dad and Greg Armstrong put this together. This is part of the old barn that was here. This goes to Mr. Chad Wright. Yeah. Woo -hoo -hoo! Yeah. And so then, cool. uh, man, you're gonna have to get somewhere to hang all these quilts up. <laughs> uh, Mom put together another quilt for Mr. Wright. Nice. Yeah, man. Yeah, he gets one. Yeah, he gets one. Constellation <laughs> Memento. <laughs> remember, I got, I got this one. <laughs> he still gets to keep that one. one. Keep that one. Yeah. It's a '96. I'll get you this one. Day. Would, uh, would somebody like to lead us in prayer just to close out the event? Sure. God, we thank you for this day. We are grateful that we have a place like this where we can come and enjoy our freedom to move our bodies in wonderful ways across this course, across this free land. We thank you that you are here all this time, helping us all through it. We thank you for the, the owners of this property that they graciously led us on here. And all the, uh, all the tough things that happened today and yesterday, we're just glad that we got to have the opportunity to do it. We thank you in your Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Amen.